take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Endometritis is an inflammatory condition of the lining of the uterus and is usually due to an infection. It's usually not life-threatening, but it's important to get it treated as soon as possible. It will generally go away when treated by your doctor with antibiotics. Let's help you make your mark. A woman with PID may not always have symptoms. If she does, she'll likely feel pain in her lower abdomen, belly, area. Symptoms of PID can include lower abdominal, belly, pain and or lower back pain. Make your mark, take our lead. You can also get PID without having an STI. Normal bacteria in the vagina can travel into a woman's reproductive organs and can sometimes cause PID. Sometimes the bacteria travel up to a woman's reproductive organs because of douching. Take our lead. Diagnosis. Blood testing, a complete blood count, or CBC, can be used to monitor for possible infection or assess inflammatory conditions. Cervical cultures, the doctor may take a swab from the cervix to look for chlamydia, gonorrhea, or other bacteria. Wet mount, endometrial biopsy, laparoscopy or hysteroscopy. Let's help you make your mark. But symptoms of PID can also start suddenly and quickly. They can include pain or tenderness in the stomach or lower abdomen, belly, the most common symptom. Abnormal vaginal discharge, usually yellow or green with an unusual odor. Make your mark, take our lead. When bacteria from the vagina or cervix travel to your womb, fallopian tubes, or ovaries, they can cause an infection. Most of the time, PID is caused by bacteria from chlamydia and gonorrhea. These are sexually transmitted infections, STIs. Having unprotected sex with someone who has an STI can cause PID. Thank you for watching, please subscribe and hit the bell notification.